Hey cute people, yes it's another haul video and it's going to be next to the last haul video beauty that is for 2019 because I told you guys in the last video what my plans are, hopefully it'll work out to be that way. I think it can because I really don't have interest in anything else. Some things may come on the horizon and I may want them but I'm going to have to talk myself out of it because... When you see this haul and some of the other stuff I hold on Cyber Monday, it's like, why? But anyway, this is a Julia's Place haul. Nothing but Julia's Place here. And I'm just going to show you some of the things that I purchased. I said it in the last video. I'm going to say it again. Julia's Place, when you have these great sales, which for the longest you have been having some fantastic sales, even before Black Friday and Cyber Monday, because I think I showed you um, in the last one or two videos ago, that um, I purchased some stuff from Julia's Place. But um, this particular sale here was their Black Friday sale. And I used Afterpay. So I just went off pretty much. But the sale was a great one. So I did a lot. And like I said, when you purchase from Julia's Place, if you have before, then you know you wait a long time for your product. And then this is going to be their Black Friday sale. Great prices, fantastic prices, and you guys need some help because no way I should order my product on, mm, let's say, December 1st. And then I don't hear anything from you about shipping until, say, December 10th. You send me an email saying that it's been sent to the shipper, but then I don't get any information about tracking until, say, December 15th. I'm just exaggerating the dates, but it's pretty much like this. And then I'm watching the track and I see nothing goes on. And then two days later, I see that I'm going to receive the package, say, on the 19th. Yeah, something like that. And then um, I get the package a little earlier, so that's okay. But it took forever. But here's my um, box from Juvia's Place. Here it is, here it is, here it is. And one thing about um their packaging, I don't think they pack very well. I got some shadow palettes and I'm glad that nothing was broken. But this is all they pack it in. Um, if you can see this, I showed you the box. I took everything out of the box and this is it. And when the mailman dropped it, I could hear the plank on the, the um, porch when he dropped it. If something had broken i would have been very upset because these people from what i know and understand they don't um refund anything they don't exchange anything so if something's broken i think i have to send them a picture or whatever i don't like all that but hey it's what they do they had a great sale so i just sold you through it everything turned out to be fine so let me just show you the stuff i got because already we're in three minutes and i'm still yammering rambling <laughs> i purchased two four six seven nine things like I said, this sale was fantastic. So I hope you caught some stuff. And then I used the code Duke that, which gave me an extra 10% off. And that was about $8. And good thing for me, I did order quite a few things. And luckily, I chose Afterpay, which I've chose Afterpay with them before. But these are the things that I brought, starting with the Shade Sticks and the I Am Magic Concealer. One thing I can say, the packaging with these products gorgeous this coral color gorgeous everything about it is gorgeous so now i'm going to show you the concealer now i wasn't really sure which concealer shade i wanted to get i watched several videos and it looks like 11 and 12 are very popular so i picked 12 which would be lighter than 11 if i'm doing it right but here is the actual concealer package nice and thick as you can see and here's how big it is So let's see here. Beautiful color, right? You can see it. Let me see if I can get the light. Well, you can see it because the light, there it is. The light isn't blocking it out. But I got number 12, and here's what the color looks like. I'm going to swatch it for you. That's number 12. All right. I think I can get with number 12. It's not really light. It will give me some um, highlight around my eyes, so that's really good. So I got that. And I know I hold before their foundation, but I wanted to try this here. This foundation, I believe they were only like $7, I think. And the regular price is $14. Let me see. The foundation stick was $8, it says there. This is the foundation stick. And I have the shade. Okay, let's get with this name. 
Abidjan, 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 Abidjan. Now I heard the name before. I should know how to say it. This is the packaging here, and this is the shade stick. When I looked at it previous to me, it looked like someone ran their hand over it or did something. I don't know, but this is the shade. I don't know how it's gonna look on me. I hate um trying to make a purchase of a foundation or even a concealer online. I wanted to go to um Ulta to kind of swatch some things, but I didn't get a chance to. But there is the foundation stick, and I'm not really sure this gonna be my color. I don't know. It looks kind of red. I wish I could um, remember exactly what the undertones were for this one here, but I don't know. I don't think I like it too much. Okay, so since I wasn't really sure about the shade, I wasn't going to buy anything else to conceal and and um, highlight and contour with. I bought that as a foundation to do that foundation, but I'll try it on. So I did get some palettes two four six seven palettes and as you can see behind me i have quite a few other palettes which i did haul before so if i remember to i'll try to put the card up above so you can see some of the other palettes that i picked up and um i just love their palettes i think they are gorgeous and can be used for art <laughs> in your own is gorgeous so i got the magic mini and this is really pretty. It tells me the opposites attract. There's some things on the on the back of some of them, not all of the palettes. I'm not going to read it because it takes some time, but I do want to show you the palettes. As you know, I am going to be keeping the um, sleeves. I just do why, I don't know, but I don't get rid of them. And here's the package. Well, the palette. I showed you the package. I mean, look at it. Can you see? Yeah, here it is a little bit better kind of washed out by those lights but um these palettes are always just so pretty gorgeous okay here there's the goddesses and here is the shade one thing would be nice if these palettes had a mirror but then again with the um goddesses the illustration i think that makes up for it because it's so pretty. It's just so pretty, pretty, pretty. So I got this palette. And I'm really happy that I got it. I know, I know. You're probably saying, girl, stop showing us these palettes and show us a look. I, I will do one again. But I told you guys, and you think I'm joking, it's so hard for me to see when I put on makeup. Even like today, I'm supposed to be stepping out for a moment. And it's like, oh gosh, I can't see what I'm doing. <laughs> I know. But anyway, I got this palette here. This is the Saharan. Okay. Really, really pretty. This color here, I don't know what you would call it, but it's gorgeous. It's not pink. It's like a pinkish orange coral color. And y'all, 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 it's still in the package. So, let's see. This, does this one have? Yes. Uh, Lively Saharan. It has something here of why and how come this palette came to be. But, I ain't got time for all that. Here's the package here. And, this has names. I didn't really pay attention to the other one if it had names on it. But, this one here. Here it is. It does have names of the... really really pretty one beautiful goddess there okay let me just read what this says a lively saharan inspired by the vibrancy and vivaciousness of the wodabi festivities festivities in the falani culture of west africa filled with elaborate and flamboyant makeup the saharan pressed pigment palette is endowed with pops of colors earthy hues and glows that emulate a true saharan okay here we go Again, something else that's really, really pretty. Okay, so I also picked up the Warrior 3. Really, really pretty. I mean, just look at the packaging. The colors will get you along, especially if you see it in Ulta. You're like, oh gosh, I have got to get this palette and all the other ones. And here it is. 
da 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 really gorgeous. And this one here has something else too. You are a warrior, but I'm not going to read it. Yes, I wish that I could read them all, but oh, this palette is so gorgeous. Look at it. It is gorgeous. Look. Here it is. Ooh, look at that blue and look at the green and that pink. Yeah. And this is like a, a burnt orange something, like a burnt orange. No, I think this is, I would say this is more like a burnt orange, but this is orange too. Oh, this is really, really pretty. You know, since I won't be doing hauls as much, I'm going to have to um, start getting in front of this camera with some of this makeup because I'm serious. I cannot do any more purchasing of makeup. I have enough, don't you think? And I cannot say and will not say I have every Juvia's Place palette, but I did want all that I could see on the website. And if I haven't gotten there, I'm slowly getting there, but I got to slow down. And this is the Saharan 2 by Juvia's Place. Another pretty palette. Spice up your eyes. What it says on the back here. Yeah. Spice up your eyes. Yes. Okay, let's see what this beautiful palette looks like. Because I only looked at them once and I never picked them up again. Like I said, I only had it for a few days. But I need to start putting this stuff away because I have a whole bunch of junk like right here on the floor beside me and um, I'm gonna crush something. Okay, so here is the Sub Saharan 2 by Julia's Place. And here is the palette. No beautiful goddesses on the inside, but still a beautiful pattern. And here's the palette. I like every color in this palette here. Ooh, especially this color here, you can't really see it. I know I should be swatching. But I can't really, okay, there, you can see the color a little bit more. It's really pretty. But I really can't swatch because it'll take me forever because I like to talk for all. But these palettes, I'm sure if you are a true makeup lover, you've seen them before. But I just want to show them to you and especially share the fact that if you're looking for um, a great sale, you need to check out Julia's Place. Now, Christmas is only a couple of days away because today is Sunday. So you may not be able to catch those sales, but check it out. Maybe you can get something for after Christmas. Say, oh, I'm sorry I didn't buy you a gift, but I have something for you after Christmas. I don't know. This is the Nomad by Julia's Place. You know, I wasn't really sure if I wanted this palette, um, the Nomad Eyeshadow, Eyeshadow Palette. I wasn't really sure if I wanted this palette only because I'm not sure if, I, if I'm if i in love with the color story. But I ended up getting it anyway because it ended up to be so inexpensive. I figured, why not? Here's the palette itself. I'm not really sure how much I paid for it. But, um... Yeah, it was on sale. I guess the, the color pay the, the color story is a pretty one, but I wasn't sure how I felt about it. But this is a really pretty palette for the fall for sure. You can see these beautiful colors. I know this seems like it's coming out like a forest green, but this is more like what I would call um like a army or what do you call that? Army or khaki green or something but it's really really pretty the palette itself but like I said I wasn't really sure about the palette itself because I'm not in love with this color here nor this color here I'm like okay and this is a dark brown color this brown I don't know what it looks like maybe that may show okay there it is I think you can see that it's brown there but I really wasn't sure about it, especially when it first came out and people were doing looks with it. The looks were very pretty, very nice, but I wasn't sure if it was for me. But like I mentioned, it was on sale, a great price, so I figured I may as well just go on and get it. So I did. And then I'm going to show you another eyeshadow palette. And after the eyeshadow palette, I'm going to show you a blush palette. So I did go ahead and get the Afrique. Okay. And again, look at this pretty orange. Ooh, it's so pretty. Now, one thing I will say about Juvia's Place, when you go on the website and you're going to make a purchase, look at their bundles because they have some good bundles 
um, with some of the eyeshadows put together. So if you don't have a lot of um, Juvia's Place palettes, instead of buying one, then buy another, look at their bundles because a lot of the bundles come with um, highlighter palette, um, palettes or the powders or whatever it is. But yeah, just look at the bundles. Yeah, because you may be able, because like with this palette here, or no, another palette that I have, um, they have like that palette and some other palettes in a bundle, which comes out to be a great price. But I already had like two of the palettes in the bundle, so it didn't make sense for me to buy two more. Because then that really is a waste of money because the palettes would be sitting around like all the other palettes I have. <laughs> so... <laughs> Why well, get it? But check out the bundles first. And now this here that I mentioned is the Afrique palette. Okay, let's see what this one looks like. Cause I don't remember this one too much. Oh, okay. Now this palette here, no beautiful goddess on the inside, but a beautiful design. And here's the palette. Really, really pretty. Look at that pretty gold there. Oh my goodness. Look at these. Just look at the colors. Just, just look at the colors. Yes, yes. And this is the Afrique palette. Really, really pretty. Great for. I can say you can use this palette at any time, really, um, to give yourself a beautiful look. And let me see here. Let's see. You know, one thing I can say about me, like before, I'm getting stuck on certain palettes and then I just keep using those palettes like over and over again and as you can see that's the palette I've been using prior to me using this one I was using the other Too Faced palette which I can't think of the name of it now and I just use it over and over and over and over because I always have it sitting there so when I want to put on makeup it's right there and I just put it on but I'm going to move on to something else but I do want to play with some more colors in that palette first i don't know that's just my psyche okay so here is the saharan blush palette i got the volume one i got volume one um volume two i'd have to look at it in ulta to see if it's something i ever want to purchase i don't think i would ever purchase any juvia's place makeup from ulta i think what i would do is just wait until it goes on sale at juvia's place because they always have a sale and good sales 40 percent off 60% off. Like I said, they have a sale now. I can't remember what the sale is, but I didn't stay on the website long. I had to flee because there was other things I could have purchased, but I said, no, I don't need it. But here's the blush palette. And I got this blush palette for one color. For one color. I mean, I will use it for the other colors that are in here. But I mean, look at these colors. I mean, look, look at these shades. Look at these shades. I got it for that color right here. Right there. This brown right here, I would definitely try that as a blush, you know, just by yourself, because, you know, not too much of it, but yes. And this pink right here, can you see this pink? Look at that. Oh, there it, okay. There it is. Look at that pink. It's pretty. But I like this color right here. And I think you can use those for highlights. This would probably be really pretty if you tap into this one and this together, or these two together. Maybe even these two together. Oh my goodness, yes. I cannot wait to use these palettes. I can't wait to use these palettes. But I have other palettes that I want to play in before I get to this one. And if you've watched my haul, you'll know hauls. You'll know exactly what I mean. Because I picked up some really fantastic palettes. And I really need to start using them more. Um, usually when I wear makeup, going out or wherever, yeah, I always wear, um, eyeshadow on my eye. I don't necessarily have to do a whole lot or a whole bunch, but I always like to have color on my eye. I think color on your eyes makes your whole face just brighten up, brighten up more than anything. Even more than lipstick or lip color. And believe me when I say, my lips have not chapped today. Because I have recorded some videos with my lips chapped. Yeah, because you guys know I don't absorb B12. I need to take the supplements, but I don't do it all the time. So when I don't, my lips chap. And then when I want to do a video, my lips are chapped. I try to peel the skin off and then it really hurts, but I do the video anyway. And then when I look back at the video, I notice that my lip is cracked. And I'm like, whatever, it's going up anyway. I am really close to 60, so I do care, but I don't care. 
Um, yeah, so yeah, so everything seemed to be okay today. Now my nose is running a little bit, but I did do a nose check before I did the video. So hopefully everything worked out okay. And then I ran my brow gel through my eye. That's the day I'm having. A really nice day. But anyway, yeah, so that's the stuff that I picked up from old, no, Juvia's place. Yeah. And um, I just wanted to show you guys, and especially those of you who want to make a purchase with Juvia's Place, you really, really need to check out these sales they've been having. Like I said, they've been having sales before Black Friday. And um, when I looked the other night, they still had a sale going on. And I believe some of them were bundles. And like I mentioned, if you check out the bundles, you may be able to get quite a few palettes at one time at a great price as opposed to one here well, I mean, I'm not telling you what to buy, but I'm just saying. Yeah, was it a one here and then another one and another one? And then when you look back at the bundles, you'd be like, oh, wow, I could use these four palettes, but you already have two because you purchased them before. I'm just saying. That's my logic. But anyway, yeah, I'm looking at the television screen because the movie that I was looking at is going off, which is okay. But yeah, I'm going to end this video now because as usual, it's a long one and I'm really sorry about that. But I do hope that you guys have taken the time to get to the end of the video. And yeah, but like I said, I'm going to end this video because I want to go to Dollar General. I want to get some snacks for later on this evening. It's Sunday. I don't know when you'll see this video, but hopefully you'll see it before the new year. I think you will see it before the new year. <laughs> But listen, if you got to the end of the video right here, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. You may as well do it for more me. I mean, like, why not? You like somebody who talks a lot? That's me. You like somebody who shops a lot? That's going to be me till the end of 2019. 2020 is going to be something totally different because I can't be spending money on makeup and I can't wear it. If I looked at my... um collection of makeup eyeshadow palettes i'll realize that a lot of them i haven't even dipped my brush into as a matter of fact i'm gonna do that so stay tuned for that if you just want to see the palettes that i have purchased and haven't even used as a matter of fact i'll call it my north carolina eyeshadow collection because i've already did a north carolina foundation collection so hopefully you'll check that out but again i'm going to end this video because it's getting longer and longer by the minute and i just want to say thank you very much for stopping by and watching this video Hopefully, I'll see you in the next. And you know I want you to do nothing but share and spread love.